Hey guys, what's going on? It's been about a week, so I figured let's do another studio update. Show you what I got on the desk this week. Not a whole lot to show off this week. Um, these are the only two projects that I've started working on. These guys in particular, Skull Crushers of Corn. I'm going to fully paint these and put these up for sale, uh, hopefully soon. Uh, we got two guys. Well, well actually, now one of them is the standard bearer. We got just a dude with a, uh, it's like a hand weapon and a shield, and then the champion there. These models, like, I was just going to assemble them and put them up for sale. After I got them assembled and really took a close look at them, I just can't resist. I really want to paint these up. So uh, these will be probably my primary focus over the next uh, couple of weeks, trying to get these fully painted as fast as possible. To go along with them, we have a unit of Wood Elf Glade Guard. I uh, only can find one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine bases. So there's only going to be nine Glade Guard. Um, they're probably not going to be painted. Uh, they're just going to be sold, just uh, assembled. So, but I might change my mind on that. I don't know. It depends on how the week goes. So that's really about it. Um, made a few sales, put a couple things up for sale. You know, it's been a pretty, pretty decent week. Um, like I said, these are the only two projects I got working on right now. So let's just do a little crossfade here and I'll show you the finished Shaltari gates and my army so far. So this is my army so far for Drop Zone Commander. You saw the video, or at least I hope you saw the video that I put out uh, about a week ago of me painting that Eden gate back there. And I finished the other two that I bought along with it to give me a total of three gates which uh, it isn't enough to transport everything I have here. Uh, you need to have um, the total number of mass points that your army totals up to. You, you need to have enough gates to transport it through. So I need to, of course, order some more. But I am just building this army little by little as I can afford it. If you remember the, uh, the, the Coyote War Strider here, I'm still waiting on that command node. I'm really starting to play around with the option of just molding one myself out of green stuff because uh, it doesn't look like I'm going to be getting a command node for this anytime soon. Back behind here, these are the AA tanks. You have uh, every army in the game pretty much has two, two types of tanks. You have your main battle tanks and you have your anti-aircraft tanks. That's what these guys are. These are known as Kukri AA tanks. Behind them the three gates, like you, you saw in the other video, that's the three of them all finished and looking nice and jazzed up with their shiny gloss. I fucking love them. I could give a gloss to everything in my army, by the way. I don't know if you can really pick it out. But in the front here, these are Tomahawk... Oh, come on, don't do this. These three tanks in the front are Tomahawk main grab tanks. These are the main battle tank for the Shaltari. Um, I broke from my Halo theme gave the guns a, a red finish because uh, the, Shaltari, the Shaltari are aren't known for using camouflage or anything like that. They go for bright extravagant colors. Um, they view camouflage as cowardly tactics and all that so I figured their big heavy, hit, heavy hitter tanks need to have a nice flashy gun. And then behind them I have some uh, some Yari scout tanks with AA guns. My two Thunderbird gunships back here with anti-air or uh, anti-tank uh, short-barreled Gauss cans on them. It's essentially a short-barreled version of the uh, the gun that the main battle tank comes with, and the same thing here, Gauss cannons on this as well. Four stands of infantry. These are Braves. I painted them up to resemble the elites from Halo, and they're transports. So yeah, I'll probably eventually I'll do a Drop Zone Commander video, but not right now. So thanks a lot guys for watching this week, and I'll see you later.